and welcome to Drawing Together with me. We are continuing on Tangle Patterns to, or TanglePatterns.com and today it is this pattern that we're going to do. So let's open up the book and find the space for this pattern. Um, this is another grid pattern so I'm just gonna pop it in here and I'm using my black Micron PN for this. Just uh, getting this grid ready. So uh, I am going to make my grid right here. Um, and I have a crooked line here, but I'm actually going to go over like that. And then I'm going to make my grid. Oops, I've got a bit crooked. It's okay. I'm just gonna work with that and then uh, into squares and one right there like that. So this is gonna be a little crooked but it actually works perfect and I sometimes and sometimes I actually think that crooked is really cool instead of on the normal straight so here I'm going to go in and make these uh, lines and I'm going to do that on all of these. So I'm placing one of these lines from one corner to the other one and they are all going in the same direction. It won't work the same if it's uh, uh, being mirrored in the opposite boxes here. So that's the first part. Here we are working with a fragment again. It's a fragment in these uh, in the grid. Um, so the grid here is called a reticular and what you put into the grid is a fragment. Um, then I am going to do this um, C shape kind of thing like this and I'm gonna do the same over here this C shape and I'm gonna do that on all of these Um, right here. Uh, you should be able to see a little of it right there. And then this last one right there. So that's the start of it. I'm just giving it a second to dry. And then I'm going in here and I'm making a line from this corner under that thing there and then to the next corner and I'm doing this in all of these from the corner under this thing in the middle and to the other corner should be able to see it right here as well and then we are going to do the C shape but under 
the first one and here I'm starting where this line ends so that they kind of connect here in the corners so here and out and then it starts there and ends here at the line up there so I'm starting at this point and going down then I start right here and I hit this one down here so I'm starting on this one and ending on this one and I'm still trying to uh, put the C shape in there and almost there and this one uh, here that's my big cat complaining about something no what. So that's the pattern. Yeah. Yeah. I'm switching to my light brown micron 01 uh, to get a little color in there. You don't have to do this but um, I'm gonna do that. So here in these uh, empty rooms I'm just gonna color in these uh, places in between so we have like a pattern going uh, and I'm just coloring in these places there's in between maybe you have a color with a bigger uh, tip that will fill these rooms a little faster otherwise just take your time relax and enjoy the coloring process relax in your shoulders and your hands and your fingers and just enjoy the process I'm just coloring in the background right here
Almost done now. Just this little room over here and then we're done with the coloring. Maybe you have a few more rooms or so. Just relax and take your time. And if you want to work together with me then you can pause the video until you are done and you're ready to go on. But take it in your time and relax. I'm going to take my graphite pin and I'm placing some graphite right here where uh, these uh, lines are going under the other one. And I'm using my Sotilion to drag the graphite out like that. And I'm gonna do that everywhere where uh, the lines are going under. again alternating between my graphite pen and my uh, totillon a tiny bit of an overlap right there so I'm just gonna do that as well there we go then you <coughs> sorry about that then you can take your white charcoal if you want to and maybe place something a little dot of white here in the connections And using the tortillon to uh, push it into the paper. There we go. That looks very nice. So that was the tangle for today. It was this tangle right here. That was pretty fun and I like the result of it. Thank you for watching. Have an attitude of gratitude.